Can you guess how many times an asteroid got close to hitting the Earth this year? Too many. As we live our lives on the ground, we're clueless to the space debris flying past us. Just last October 1st, an asteroid flew closer to the Earth than most satellites do. Its name was 2025 TF. It flew over Antarctica just 265 miles above the Earth's surface. That's the same distance as the International Space Station from the Earth. Thankfully, it didn't hit. It was also only 9.8 feet large at most. If it entered the Earth's atmosphere, most of it would burn off, leaving a small meteorite to impact the ground. What about a bigger visitor? Last September 18th, an asteroid the size of a skyscraper visited Earth. We're revolutionizing space. We're doing things differently. Investing in our ideas and innovations to prove and deploy new capabilities faster than ever. Advancing space exploration with new business models and proven technology. Powering a lunar economy and deep space travel. We're shaping the future to make history again. This is the 2025 FA-22. It's somewhere between 427 to 951 feet across. That's big enough to completely obliterate a major city. Its orbit comes so close to the Earth that it was actually on NASA's major risk asteroid list. Thankfully, it missed. It passed the Earth by at a distance of 520,000 miles, traveling at 24,000 miles per hour. That's twice the distance between the Earth and the Moon. What about a meteorite that actually landed? This meteorite smashed through a Georgia homeowner's home. Last June 26th, a meteor exploded over Georgia, loud enough to create a sonic boom. Its fragments landed all over the area. One of them ripped through someone's roof. Scientists studied the fragments and found that the meteor formed 4.56 billion years ago. That's about 20 million years older than the Earth. This is just one of several media visits in modern memory. So while a giant media landing on Earth sounds straight out of science fiction, it's a proven threat NASA actually has an entire branch just for monitoring all the asteroids that might jeopardize the Earth. It's called the Earth's Planetary Defense System. To date, NASA have noted and categorized over 30,000 asteroids with orbits that could bring them near Earth. Thanks to them, we can hopefully spot any world-destroying asteroids before they get anywhere near.